Hey guys, welcome back. This is the third part from lecture number 63 of our bootcamp series. In this lecture, we will discuss about first and last query methods for active record. The first and last methods will return the first and last object of a model respectively. For example, let's open a Rails console and try to run student.first. Okay, so this will give you the first student from the database. And if you run first.last, a student.last, this will give you the last student from the database. Now, let's uh, try to execute the first and last uh, methods on a model which uh, does not have any record. So let's try to see demo.all. Okay, so we do not have any record in demo.all. So if you execute demo.first, you will get a nil. And if you execute demo.last, you will also get nil. But if you execute demo dot first with bang operator you will get an error that is the same exception we got with bang operator and find by that is active record record not found okay because you are trying to find the first object forcefully okay or in destructive way now if you do the same thing with last demo dot last bang operator you will again see the same error okay and now these first and last methods are very rarely used but uh, we should have idea about that because sometimes not on the direct active record models but we sometimes we need to apply this first and last method on uh, where query result as well okay and uh, association results as well for example let's say student dot student equal to student dot first or let's say find one okay now student dot blocks here you can see i have a collection of student blocks now if i need to find the first block of the student then i can use it like student dot blocks dot first okay so i can apply this first and last method on any of the active record relation object okay so if you find student dot first it means you are trying to apply the first method on a student in, entire student collection and if you are trying to uh, apply first method on a where re query result it means that you are trying to apply first method on an active record relation object okay so this is how you can use first and last method but make sure that if you use with bank operator then the model must have at least one instance in it okay else you will get an active record record not found exception okay so this is all about first and last methods so very simple method try this at your end and we will meet in another lecture with where query so till then thanks for watching this tata goodbye take care and stay safe